Do you know what happens when you move faster than light? The faster we move, the slower our time flows, eventually stopping when we reach the speed of light. If we accelerate beyond that, time will start flowing backward. An observer moving at a normal speed would see cause and effect switch places inside our spacecraft. It's not surprising, considering that time will run backward for elementary particles as well, and all their properties will change to their opposites. Chemical reactions will reverse, photosynthesizing plants will emit light, mitochondria will break down ATP into oxygen and glucose, and fire will freeze instead of heating. The reason for all this lies at the subatomic level. Charged particles will start rotating in the opposite direction, reversing their charges. Electrons will become positrons, and protons will become antiprotons, meaning matter will transform into antimatter. When matter encounters antimatter particles, they will annihilate each other until everything turns into cosmic radiation. That's why it's so challenging to find antimatter in space, as antimatter is matter moving backward in time, 